you are will always be able to tell the story about being the there at Holderness when, when we revived Mountain Day. You're the inaugural Stickney Chapel Mountain Day group. You are sitting in really an architectural treasure right now. And I want you to take in the weight of this place and the stillness of the stones and let them call you into something bigger and deeper and more lasting than whatever it is that was beeping on your phones this morning. There's something about the world we inhabit that is charged and alive with divine possibility. If only we would tune in to the right frequency. If only we would slow down and open up and take a breath and have the courage to be with our thoughts and be with our, our minds and our hearts. I said it so loud. I was right here. Hi guys. Hey! <laughs> We're all fallen and we need a place to hide. Safe place somewhere in the woods we can start a fire All we know is what will be our home We will stay until the break of dawn that the mountains are our best classroom. We believe that nature is our best teacher. The cold night takes us to a place to escape the chill. This public land is the backdrop for our school. It's the backdrop for our ski hills. It's where we go to climb and to bike, to trail run. It's where we go for outback. It's a really important part of who we are as a school. In between our toes. Is there a way back? Nobody knows. And we leave. This is your land. Right? You guys live here. This it's public land. It belongs to you. And it's conserved for your benefit, for your recreation, so that you have clean air, clean water, so that you have a natural place to go for inspiration and rejuvenation. And that's Incredible. And we all sit around the fire. We feel a little warmer now. And we all 